Jackson Live in the studio this morning is Travis Parker. He's here to talk about a popular program that helps a lot of Dothan kids. Yes, so good morning, Mr. Travis, for being here. How are you doing? How's that driving to Dothan? Oh, except for the <coughs> traffic lights downtown. <laughs> and you showed the construction of many. <laughs> yeah. You were familiar with that this Yeah, morning. yeah, unfortunately. All right, well, you were here to talk about Shop with the Cop. Tell people at home who may not know what that is, what it is. Okay, all right, uh, basically what we do is started uh, a few years back, we take five kids that maybe are not in trouble themselves but had bad experiences with law enforcement officers and what we do is we partner them with a police officer or a sheriff's deputy. We get uh, four enterprise police and one sheriff's deputy for the day and that's their, their buddy, their partner for the whole day and they go shopping, uh, go eating, uh, go to a movie or go bowling, different things like that. So they just have a, a chance to see that the police officer is not the bad guy, the boogeyman, you know, in blue, mm -hmm. so that they're actually people just like them. Absolutely. So it just gives a, a positive reinforcement yeah. to it. Okay, and how did this come about? How did this okay. idea start? Yeah, it started in, in 2018. Um, I don't remember how exactly. Uh, I, I thought about the idea, but I had seen it somewhere as other people were doing it. So we adapted. We talked to the police department and said they were all for it. So then we talked to uh, uh, Zinsivitan and Hand Up Enterprise, got them as sponsors. Um, then we went out door to door knocking and trying to get donations and put it all together and we do a back to school and then a uh, Christmas version. Gotcha. So, so Ian, you touched on a little bit, but what are some of the things that they're going to experience when they go out with the police officer? Okay, and the fun yeah, the, it starts at 9 in the morning, we meet at City Hall, uh, the police uh, officers, uh, the captain and the chief will introduce themselves. Uh, they go up to city council, uh, we'll do like a maybe mock city council session or a little <coughs> court session there. The mayor comes out, talks to him a little while. Then they get in the, the police car that get ride with their partner for the day. They go out shopping, then we go to Chick-fil-A, eat lunch, uh, go back shopping some more. And normally been going to uh, a movie in the afternoon, but this last time we changed it up, went to Fort Rucker. They got a, uh, another partner with an MP, so they had two law enforcement officers mm -hmm. with the one kid, so the trio then went out, they went bowling, I uh, went to the museum, did a scavenger hunt there, went to the airfield, uh, saw the hill, uh, Black Hawk helicopters and stuff like that. Awesome. Then we come back and end up with Milky Moose because nice. you always, always oh, end up yeah. some ice cream. <laughs> that's, that's the highlight of the day right yeah. there. <laughs> yes, Absolutely. And if I know kids like I think I know kids, they hear let's go shopping, they don't care where the money's right. coming <laughs> from. <laughs> yeah. So talk about how this is funded. Okay, we get donations from uh, like Hand Up Enterprises, a big donor, uh, Woodman Life, uh, Sift Hands chipped in, uh, several different organizations, individuals. Will, will donate cash because uh, I will give the, the police officer a some cash and then I give them gift cards like Walmart, um, uh, Dollar General, uh, Dollar Tree, different places that have donated gift cards. So we, we give them probably close to $200 worth of stuff that day wow. to go out and uh, they just have fun. It's a blast. And actually the, the cops get more out of it really than the kids and they'll say, is it okay if we keep up with the kids afterwards and said that's the idea oh, yeah. of this mm -hmm. is to get that bond going you know and it's a long-term relation mm -hmm. and it's a beautiful program so I'm sure some people at home if they they're liking what they're hearing I don't know how you couldn't where could they get involved to help you out if they okay. want to be a sponsor? yeah you can uh, uh, be a donor as far as gift cards or a financial uh, donor send it to info at coffeecountyveterans.org and uh, or you can just get up with me. I'm easy to find enterprise pretty much everybody knows me. All right and the so date of this as well. It's gonna be August 4th Okay, and how do we Day get kids school. involved? It, um, like, how are the kids chosen? I'm sorry, I know we only oh, okay. have about 30 yeah, seconds. Okay, uh, Hand Up Enterprise uh, partners with uh, Coffee County, uh, uh, the uh, Department of uh, Health, and different organizations down there. Uh, also, John Gunner at uh, Coffee County Baptist Association has helped pick some because we work at the, uh, the, the children over at Martin's Trailer Park. So, different organizations will help pick, you know, give me some suggestions and we go from there. 